एवरीवन माय नेम इज अलेक्या असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर इन साइबर सिक्योरिटी डिपार्टमेंट सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द टॉपिक ऑन केस स्टडी ऑन ईमेल स्पूफिंग इंस्टेंसेस सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल व्हाट इज ईमेल स्पूफिंग सो ईमेल स्पूफिंग इज लाइक समवन हु इज ट्राइंग टू टेक टेक द कंट्रोल ओवर ऑफ अवर अकाउंट डिटेल्स लाइक ईमेल्स पास ईमेल्स पासवर्ड्स एंड दे आर ट्राइंग टू स्पूफ दैट पर्टिकुलर मेल and that they will try to send those uh, wishes but as they wish they'll try to send some messages like that so today our contents are case studies on email spoofing instances in that only we are having email bombing involving a foreigner and the pidan has tragedy with children so these are the three topics today we are going to discuss through three case studies so we'll discuss the differences among them and which type of the attack is and what will be the effect among the case study <clears throat> email spoofing instances first one so it is one of the case studies that was uh, done by an, an american teenager he made millions of dollars by spreading false information only just spreading false information he has made millions of dollars about certain companies who share he had short sold so he had uh, short sold some shares among certain companies and they, he he try to uh, spread false information and this misleading information was spread by sending spoofed emails purportedly like uh, from news agencies like routers to share brokers and investors who were involved that the companies were doing very badly so it was misleading some information so which was spread by some sp- uh, sending spoofed emails so like that it was happened and after that even after the truth was emerged after the truth was emerged that was uh, misleading by some person the values of the shares could not be restored to the earlier level so before the uh, values are very high very good and the company's profits are also good and because of this spreading of false information the shares and the company's uh, reputation everything was damaged so this resulted in thousands of investors losing a lot of money so the share amount the share value has decreased everything was reputation was decreased so everything was decreased because of this false information because of this this resulted in thousands of investors who have invested within the shares of the company they have lost a lot of money and here this is considered as one of the cyber crime against organizations because he like the impacted organization was the one about whom false information was spread so it is one of the cyber crime and the, there is another example like email spoofing instance in incident in india so in this incident a branch of global trust bank so one of the branch of global trust bank experienced a customer run down on a bank owing to a certain rumor spread spread about the bank not doing well financially so it is like he, they had spread one information one rumor about the bank which is not doing financially so it might be uh, taken like it might be taken so under this situation many customers they have decided to withdraw all the amount of money with their accounts and the clo- and they want to close their accounts so because of this uh, spreading of information that the bank was not doing well and here it was revealed that that someone he had sent out spoofed emails so spoof demons are nothing but someone who try to send the messages which is coming from the reputed or legitimate sources and to many of the bank customers announcing that the bank was in a very bad shape financially and could close or like operations at any time so if they have closed the operations at any time the all the amount of money will be lost by the customers so because of this reason because of this reason they have taken all their amount and they have closed their accounts and so we can say that this instance of email spoofing saved many customers so we can say that they have uh, make, uh, like they have saved many customers in the way in according to cyber security the information is also breached over there so here the financial information and the con- or the confidential information 
the sensitive information which is in the bank account details bank details that will be breached that will be that that was breached by the attacker where where by sending some spoof spoof emails spoof emails so it is a loss and it is also gain for the customers as they have taken all their amount of money so in the in the, in two ways we can think and this is another one and another shocking example of email spoofing involves a former executive for a well known company in the state of gujarat so it is it is about the one of the uh, like one of the former executive so where he is well known company in the state of gujarat and here the executive faked himself to be a lady by adopting a false name and he created a fake email id so like that and using that id executive contacted a businessman based in the middle east so this uh, businessman he uh, this executive former executive he has contacted a business person which is in the middle east and the executive using uh, uh, like he is posing as a woman then went into a long cyber countering relationship with the middle east uh, businessman so he, so nowadays cyber dating is also uh, increasing very very badly where the information was exchanged the information they are they are trying to drag by using this cyber dating and it is like that it is like it is like the like that attack where they are trying to uh, drag the information where that uh, uh, from the middle east business person and cyber dating here the executive like executive they use it to send many emotional blackmails to the messages to the business person and one such message is threatened the business person that if he ended the relationship means she like the executive which is posing as a woman would end her life so if he has not done what what uh, he actually uh, told to do so he try, he is posing that he, he will and uh, like that uh, executive person he will end their and end her life so she means here the executive person so what is the worst thing is the executive gave another woman's email id to the business person and this is also non existence address only so like that so many uh, fake accounts are created by the attackers and they are trying to contact the users within the internet and what happened next so when the middle east uh, like businessman he sent a mail to the to that id he was shocked to learn that uh, the, the executive who was presented himself as a woman had died and now the police were searching him as a suspect within the dead case so it is like uh, so he he has not met that particular account a person and uh, he trying to contact with the person and what uh, what the attacker has done means attacker here who is the attacker means executive and he is trying to send the emails that that particular woman that particular lady has read and uh, from the police persons from the high courts the mails were coming like that he is pretending to be another persons so using this trap and trick the executive extorted from business businessman several hundred thousands of indian rupees and threatened that the businessman would be exposed if he did not part with this um, with that money so with the with this intention so he has planned all this and at that time what happened this business person he is trying to um, like uh, this executive is trying to blackmail that business person by uh, asking so much amount of money so it is also we can say that cyber theft cyber theft or uh, uh, like blackmailing through cyber cybers like inter through internet so it is one of the attack where he is trying to blackmail the business person so if he has not done that particular particular uh, uh, work means he will expose it to the police person like that and here the executive also sent so many emails to him from different email ids and making this poor businessman believe that they were from mails from the high court and police officials so here the executive so here the business person believe that they are these mails are from the high courts and police officials and all this are done to extract money from that uh, from that business person so he doesn't know that it is coming from the 
वन पर्टिकुलर पर्सन हु इज ट्राइंग टू ड्रैक द अमाउंट and finally the business person flew to india to lot like uh, he want to file a case with the police and internet users indeed enjoy anonymity and can get away many things so by threatening that person by uh, making that person fear uh, for that particular mails he they will enjoy everything and they'll try to drag money or the details so this is one of the Email spoofing instances. What we have, we have what we have taken. This American uh, teenager he has made millions of rupees by spreading certain amount of information. And another example is spoofing incident uh, where the global trust bank experienced a customer run down on the bank owing to be owing to a certain rumor spread about the bank which is not doing well. And this email spoofing involves former executive from a well known company in the state like uh, this executive is trying to pretend to be a lady and trying to contact with that business person which is in the middle east and he has tracked so much amount of money and this is the these are the some cases recording email spoofings so according to this what what is the attack means so he is spreading the false information so spreading false information is one of the cyber cyber crime and this is also cyber uh, email spoofing incidents in which uh, what what it is done uh, like uh, it was like spying someone and at that time it is one of the uh, active attacks where the cyber attack the, the criminal trying to drag the information by uh, by breaching the data and another shocking example is involves a former executive this is also one of the uh, a, a cyber attack so based on this we can say that this email spoofing is very dangerous like uh, it may threaten it may threaten to be like it, it may pretend to be one of the higher officials and they try to contact us so if we have got any emails from uh, any uh, per, uh, like uh, some suspects that we have to be identified and we have to detect that which is coming from and we shouldn't click on the links or anything and this cyber dating is also very dangerous nowadays and we should be aware of that and we should educate the persons who doesn't completely know about that particular cyber attacks so this is these cyber datings making uh, relationships among the internet these are all come under cyber attacks and next next uh, case study is on email bombing involving a foreigner email bombing involving a foreigner see this this example brings out an instance based on that in intense so we how important an email how uh, dangerous an email bombing is so here a foreigner had been residing in shimla so india for um, almost 30 years and he wanted to avail a scheme that was introduced by shimla housing board to buy land to lowest rates so he has invented one scheme and his application however was rejected on grounds that was that scheme was available only to indian uh, indian citizens so for that he want to take some revenge the foreigner decided to take some revenge so only why only for the indians why not for the foreigners like that he want to take some revenge and he he transmitted thousands of mails to the simla housing board so to that particular uh, board person he had sent so many emails so he did not stop there he kept on sending emails till their server crashed so he had attacked their server by sending so many requests so which it is not able to accept so it might be slow down the, uh, the server might be slow down at that time or it might be collapsed and here an interesting question is so which law of la which law of the land would have been used for filing a case against this non indian person so which law so like that we have to see and this is one of the email bombing where where he has attacked on the server and next one piranha's tragedy with children so this incident was reported in the us this incident was reported in the e us this incident was reported in the us so there was a hobby website for children so here the owner of the site received an email information in, 
in email informing Heather a group of hackers had gained control over the website. So which is the incident? Where was the incident happened? It was incident. The incident was reported in the US, and there was a hobby website for children. So nowadays children were using internet without having any knowledge. And here the what what was the case? What was the case study here? So the owner of the site received a email information informing her that a group of hackers had gained control over the website. So this information has given uh, uh, came to the owner, and they demanded a ransom of one million dollars from her. So this this particular your particular account has hacked. So if you want to uh, regain your control, you have to pay some amount like that. They have given some. Um, information through the email and what how much amount they have in uh, uh, like how much amount they have uh, uh, given like uh, how much they demanded means the demanded amount is one million dollars so this is we can say that this is one of the ransom attack this is one of the ransom attack and here they demanded for one million dollars uh, one million dollars from her and the owner was a school teacher. So how can he, she pay that particular amount? And she did not pay due to attention to the threatening mail because she did not think it was serious. First, at first, it was, uh, he didn't reply to that, that it was from a serious. And she thought that it was just a scare tactic. So which he want, they want to do a scare tactic. And so she, so she simply ignored that particular email. He has uh, left that email not uh, taking complete control over that. And after three days, what happened? She started getting several telephone calls. So several telephone calls from almost all over the country. And then she came to know that the hackers had really web jacket had website. So another another thing what happened means they he she thought that it is some ransom attack it might be it might it will come so we shouldn't take, we shouldn't click on that we should ignore that so after the three days what what happened means she started getting several telephone calls so because of that he came to she came to know that the website was web jacked so web jacked is also an a cyber attack where we can say that all the control of this uh, network was taken by the attacker. The control will be lost. Lost by the user. And what happened next? The, the hackers had, sorry, the hackers had altered a portion of the website. They have uh, modified so many changes to the website which was entitled how to have fun with goldfish so they have uh, like uh, they have uh, changed that portion of the website so much portion of the website was changed or altered by the attacker so which they have entitled they, 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 re, they retitled that particular website as how to have fun with the goldfish and they replace the word goldfish with the piranhas. So here these are the uh, like South African fishes where we can say that uh, very dangerous. So which is having uh, like flesh eating fish. So they were very tiny but extremely very dangerous. And it was sad because the battle result of this apparently minor sounding. Find and replace cyber prank. So cyber prank attack has been uh, uploaded with that particular website and many children who visited the popular website believed that what contents of the website was suggested. So unfortunately children didn't realize that what would be in their fate and they followed the instructions to playing to play uh, to try playing the piranhas and which they brought pet shops and, uh, and were very seriously injured. So they have taken to so many places like that. So they, uh, here the children also played the game. And this is this is about the, the Piranha's tragedy. So what we have discussed today. So we have discussed today about the case study on email spoofing instances and email bombing involving a foreigner 
and the piranha strategy with children so in email spoofing instances we have we have so many not only this we have so many spoofing inc incidents where the cyber attackers they try to send so much amount of uh, information they'll try to either send the uh, mail that were not accept like uh, that was not taken up by the account so because of this the uh, emails or the or our accounts will be shut down or it may be slow down so where which with or the server will be trashed the server will crash because of this total request so how that much amount of request they will send so it is one of the uh, like it is one of the attack and what happened here email spoofing here what uh, here like uh, they try to modify another thing was they try they'll try to change the particular message so it is one of the man in the middle attack where they'll try to change the message from a person to b for example a want to send some information to b like uh, so meet me uh, uh -huh. or otherwise send some particular file at 5 am to b so a is sending some information to b some uh, some uh, what you call uh, some confidential information a is sending some information to b so where in the middle of the sir, middle of the uh, two users there will be one server which is man in the middle man in the middle server where they'll try to change the information as send the file it it is 5 am no it may be 5 pm like that it will say just a small information will be changed in in the particular uh, message so it is one of the man in the middle attacks so like that so many email spoofings can be done and another uh, see, see this uh, another example so uh, email spoofing which involves a former executive this is also another uh, dangerous uh, attack where cyber dating where the involving not uh, involving the person so which is having complete identity by the another person who is not having complete identity so he, he doesn't have the original name he doesn't have the original address but they try to contact with the person's users and they'll try to drag the information what they are doing at a daily basis what they are doing what they where they go to like that they'll collect information so it may lead to so many criminal cases it may lead to so many criminal cases where the information will be used at any ways and another example another dangerous example is this uh, piranha strategy so this is also another example where we can say that the information will be dragged from the children so who is aged like uh, 13 uh, 13 like the teenagers they'll try to drag the information from them and they'll try to uh, use that information for making so many robberies and another one and this is also another one where making the customers trust that uh, some uh, something will happen and they'll try to uh, they'll try to attack on the reputation of the reputation of the uh, companies so like that it is also one of the dangerous attack and let us discuss about the keywords so what are the keywords we can say that so what is email spoofing email spoofing is changing the emails or spoofing that it is from the reputed source or legitimate so legitimate sources so here the user feel that it is from a it is from a legitimate source user think that think it is from trusted accounts and what is a cyber crime so which leads to uh, criminal offenses so this uh, so cyber crime which uh, which leads to cyber uh, criminal offenses through the internet through the internet and what is a threat so threat is it will not be it is like we can say that it is one of the passive attack where the like uh, it will not do anything at that time 
so it is one of the threat threat is that it it will not affect at that time after execution it will the effect will be more so at first is so we can if we say if we have spyware attack so where someone is trying to watch our uh, activities or anything within the company so at that time they will not do anything so they will collect all the information for example there is a company um company shares company sales uh profit what is the profit all these details they try to collect and after that at the time um where they try to when they try to execute means at, if they want to present any new uh, product or if they want to uh, do any new things to the uh, company or they want to uh, introduce new policies to the company at the time they'll try to sorry they'll try to use these details so what is the selling cost what is the purchase like that they'll try to at that time they'll try to uh, use this details so thank you like share and subscribe hit the bell icon for more updates